if the buying process is perceived as a loss, you are going to deal with a lot of negativity because loss is painful. Uh, loss of money, loss of time and effort, loss of time, effort and money. And you're going to be faced with people that is going to be uh, short and abrupt with you. Um, no, no thanks. Or people that is going to uh, accuse you of being a spammer. Or even worse, people that's just going to ignore you. And that's probably the worst thing we can do to each other, is ignoring each other. We call it ghosting on social media platforms because you're really nullifying that person's existence. But if the buying process is perceived as a gain, something they really, really want, you're going to have a very positive experience and ultimately gain clients that way. Now, what makes this difficult is we're dealing with humans. And humans can be very complicated and complex. We're also not dealing with realities. We're dealing with perceptions. So how do we ensure that we make the buying process a perception of something to gain? The no like and trust factor comes into play. And this is what LinkedIn marketing, social selling is all about. It is about creating that no factor where people know you and then they get to like you through your content and ultimately they trust you enough to reach out and say, me too, please. I want to have what you have. Once you've achieved that, your buying processes, your selling processes in your business becomes that much, that much more easier. I had a little bit of a tongue tie there. Does that make sense? Shall we have some coffee this morning? Thank you for having coffee with me.